Congratulations and welcome to campus. You made it. Your hard work has paid off, and now you have an exciting few years ahead. You're not in high school anymore. You've got serious responsibilities, like doing your own laundry and making sure that final paper is turned in on time. But your new independence has serious benefits, too. Most important of all might be your freedom of speech, the right to speak your mind. Free speech is a big deal. Let's take a closer look. Free speech is the engine that makes learning possible. Think of campus as a busy marketplace of ideas, theories, and beliefs. By exploring the market, by discussing and debating ideas with your friends and classmates, you'll discover what sounds right to you, and you'll learn about yourself and others while doing it. And by testing out different ideas, we all get closer to the truth. President Obama agrees. It was because there was this space where you could interact with people who didn't agree with you and had different backgrounds than you that I then started testing my own assumptions. And sometimes I changed my mind. That's what college in part is all about. On a diverse campus like this one, you won't always agree with each other. And that's kind of the point. If you only ever heard from people who think the same way you do, how would you grow intellectually? You wouldn't. Free speech isn't always comfortable, and it's not always easy. But being exposed to new ideas is what makes college valuable, and you are more than strong enough to handle it. Seriously, if you go four years without ever having your beliefs challenged, you should ask for your money back, as Professor Alice Dreger will tell you. If you are serious about working on free speech, you're going to have to align yourself with people who make you uncomfortable. And that's good. When you're uncomfortable, it's a sign you're in a place where there's potential for growth. As one of my best professors said to me in graduate school, if you haven't changed your mind lately, how do you know it's working? Free speech rests on the radical idea that the best way to change the world is by talking, not fighting. Every successful social movement in our country's history has relied on freedom of expression to make a difference. The best way to persuade people and inspire others to take up your cause is by directly engaging with those who disagree with you, not shouting them down or reporting them to administrators. Student Zach Wood gets it exactly right. Ultimately, when I, when I think about the figures that I admire the most, I remember that they've stood up for things when it was difficult to stand up for what they believed in. That's Martin Luther King. That is our founding fathers. And for me, that gives me strength. To make sure you get the absolute most out of your college experience, we have one last piece of advice. Talk to each other. This incoming class contains some of the most interesting, challenging, dynamic, intelligent, and hilarious people you'll ever meet. Your job is to find them. The conversations you have here, both inside and outside the classroom, can change your life. You've got the right to speak your mind. Now go use it. Have fun. <laughs>